The genocide of Christians by ISIL refers to the persecution of Christian minorities, within its region of control in Iraq, Syria and Libya by the Islamic extremist group Islamic State of Iraq and the Levant ISIL. Persecution of Christian minorities climaxed following its takeover of parts of northern Iraq in June 2014, according to U.S. diplomat Alberto M. Fernandez. While the majority of victims in the conflict raging in Syria and Iraq have been Muslims, Christians have borne a heavy burden given their small numbers. On February 3, 2016, the European Union recognized the persecution of Christians by Islamic State of Iraq and the Levant as genocide. The vote was unanimous. The United States followed suit on March 15, 2016, declaring these atrocities as genocide. The vote was unanimous. On April 20, 2016, British Parliament voted unanimously to denounce the actions as genocide. A similar motion however failed in Canada when it was opposed by the majority of MPs in Justin Trudeau's Liberal government. <laughs> <laughs> Background The mass flight and expulsion of ethnic Assyrians from Iraq is a process which initiated with the Iraq War in 2003 and continues to this day. Leaders of Iraq's Assyrian community estimate that over two-thirds of the Iraqi Assyrian population may have fled the country or been internally displaced since the U.S.-led invasion in 2003 until 2011. Reports suggest that whole neighborhoods of Assyrians have cleared out in the cities of Baghdad and Basra, and that Sunni insurgent groups and militias have threatened Assyrian Christians. Following the campaign of the Islamic State of Iraq and the Levant in northern Iraq in August 2014, one quarter of the remaining Iraqi Assyrians fled the jihadists, finding refuge in Turkey and Iraqi Kurdistan. Timeline. Topic Topic Northern Iraq twenty fourteen Topic After the fall of Mosul, ISIL demanded that Assyrian Christians living in the city convert to Islam, pay tribute, or face execution. By July nineteenth, twenty fourteen, ISIL leader Abu Bakr al Baghdadi further noted that Christians who do not agree to follow those terms must leave the borders of the Islamic Caliphate", within a specified deadline. This resulted in a complete Assyrian Christian exodus from Mosul, marking the end of 1,800 years of continuous Christian presence. A church mass was not held in Mosul for the first time in 1,800 years. ISIL has already set similar rules for Christians living in other cities and towns, including its de facto capital Raqqa. However, on 29 March 2016, ISIL issued a decree preventing Christians from leaving Raqqa. ISIL had also been seen marking Christian homes with the letter Nun for Nasara. Christian". Several religious buildings were seized and subsequently demolished, most notably Mar Benham Monastery. By August 7, ISIL captured the primarily Assyrian towns of Karakush, Tel Kepi, Bartela, and Karamlish, prompting the residents to flee. More than 100,000 Iraqi Christians were forced to flee their homes and leave all their property behind after ISIL invaded Karakush and surrounding towns in the Nineveh Plains province of Iraq. In early November 2014, a price list for Yazidi and Christian females surfaced online. While a human rights NGO Defend International immediately verified the document's authenticity, UN official Zainab Bangura Didn. T confirm it to be genuine until August 2015. <inaudible> Libya 2015. On February 12, 2015, the ISIL released a report in their online magazine Dabak showing photos of 21 Egyptian Copts migrant workers that they had kidnapped in the city of Sirta, Libya, and whom they threatened to kill to avenge the alleged kidnapping of Muslim women by the Egyptian Coptic Church." The men, who came from different villages in Egypt, thirteen of them from al ar Minya Governorate, were kidnapped in Sirta in two separate attacks on December 27, 2014, and in January 2015. <inaudible> Syria 2015. 
On 23 February 2015, in response to a major Kurdish offensive in the al Hasaka Governorate, ISIL abducted 150 Assyrians from villages near Tel Tamer in northeastern Syria, after launching a large offensive in the region. According to U.S. diplomat Alberto M. Fernandez, of the 232 of the Assyrians kidnapped in the ISIL attack on the Assyrian Christian farming villages on the banks of the Khabar River in northeast Syria, 51 were children and 84 were women. Most of them remain in captivity, with one account claiming that ISIS is demanding $22 million or roughly $100,000 per person for their release. On the 8th of October 2015, ISIL released a video showing 3 of the Assyrian men kidnapped in Khabar being executed. It was reported that 202 of the 253 kidnapped Assyrians were still in captivity, each one with a demanded ransom of $100,000. Reactions On 2 and 3 August 2014, thousands of Assyrians, Syriacs of the diaspora protested the persecution of their fellow Assyrians within Iraq and Syria, demanding a United Nations-led creation of a safe haven for minorities in the Nineveh Plains. In October 2014, Kurdish-Danish human rights activist Wadad Akrawi dedicated her 2014 International Pfeffer Peace Award to all victims of persecution, particularly the Yazidis, the Christians, and all residents of the Kobane region." Chaldean Catholic father Douglas al-Bazi has spoken out strongly against the genocide. In December 2015, at a town hall event, the 67th United States Secretary of State, Hillary Clinton, called the systematic persecution a genocide. In February 2016, Lars Adoktasson, a Swedish member of the European Parliament from the EP group, said of the unanimous vote to recognize atrocities as genocide, it gives the victims of the atrocities a chance to get their human dignity restored. It's also a historical confirmation that the European Parliament recognized what is going on and that they are suffering from the most despicable crime in the world, namely genocide. See also Assyrian genocide Christianity in the Middle East Genocide of Yazidis by ISIL Genocide of Shias by ISIL Syrian civil war spillover in Iraq Collaboration with ISIL Persecution of Copts References, <references>